Okay, we got uh, yet another interesting video. We have, uh, it's another one for the castles. We're going to go to a, a small castle. It's only a mile up here, according to Satnav. We're down in West Wales. There's a castle there, look, right in front of me, over there. Ah, it looks quite big. Oh, it's down here, is it? No, it's not. Oh, God, I'm glad there's nothing behind me. It's a church down there, not a castle. Right turn the castle. What have we got here? That's a nice little village. Suddenly I lost sight of the castle. Oh, there it is. Right, down here. Do you know what? Isn't it typical though? Look at that. A bloody tractor. Coming down. Oh my god. Just as I want to have a look. Yeah, thank you. That's a big old beast, isn't it? Should pull off in first gear, really, not second. My gosh. Okay, no parking. Hmm. Ah, no parking. Can you believe this? I can't believe that. So we got no parking anywhere. Oh my god. to say I am a bloody disaster I've just been to go and have a look at a, a, a castle and uh, I did get something maybe I can put something up uh, but I couldn't park anywhere near it with the bike um, there was a little a small parking area about oh, I'd say 400 meters away so I just thought, do you know what? I'm not going to bother. <laughs> Which is a bit of a pity because it, it looks uh, a good castle. But, uh, probably the sort of place I'll come back to um, with my partner in the, in the car. I'm sure she'd love to have a look at it.
So we've got a bit of a change of plan now. And I'm going to go to uh, St. Govan's Chapel. Hopefully. So according to Tom Tom, this place is um, well, 17 mile now from here. The only, uh, the only problem with it is that we have to cross over Castle Martin firing range. So I haven't checked, but there's a chance it might be closed. If it is closed, I think I'll just give up. It's not bad. Is that on? Uh, I don't think you can see there on the um, the fuel consumption. Look, 56.6 to the gallon. It's coming down from Bridge End down to West Wales. Not bad at all. Yeah, and now I caught up with some other. Oh my good God! There's a like a road sweeper thing with yellow flashing lights on it, and oh. Oh, it's a tractor, look, with a, a muck spreader on it or something. Great. Of course, nobody would even attempt to overtake it. Look, see? There's a hill there, look. You, you could easily overtake going up there, look, couldn't you? But no. Let's all stay behind the tractor. for me. Stay there. Thank you. Oh, it's a nice bungalow. I do like the old bungalows, you know, the old single-story living, especially when you're getting older. Who wants to hump stuff up and downstairs? Right, I don't know what this little place is. Going over a uh, oh, caro. Ah, look at this. Bit of um dried up river there as well. I believe there's a castle here in Caro. There is. There, 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 there. Look, look, look. Oh. What's that? Wow, look at that. Karu Castle. I think that's going to be a... That would be one for the future. Zippity Duda. There's some mighty nice houses around here. Yet West Wales is famous for, for poor wages. Here we are, Pembroke. A little cottages look yeah very very bijou look at that two penny hay close hello two penny hay close yes come on Castle Martin. Oh, 
Oh, there's a bird in that car. Look. Right. Okay. Down here it says. I have no idea where I am now. It's uh, somewhere I haven't been. There is a distinct lack of uh, motorcycles out today. I've only seen about, I don't know, three, three other bikes. I suppose uh, that's what happens when uh, you're down West Wales on a, on a weekday. Well, I'm in the firing range of Castle Martin area now. Look at this. That's a old farmhouse or something. That's locked up. So, I'm expecting at any time now I could be fired at. Knowing my luck. What's this? Car park. Oh, this is looking nice, isn't it? I don't know if you can hear that gunshot sound. They were obviously um, practicing over there. Look at this. Well, I'm a little bit annoyed to be honest because this GoPro, not what I'm filming on now, this is my phone, but the GoPro is new to me and um, I've just been over there and down the cliffside to look at um, St. Govan's Chapel, of which I've got some footage on, on this phone, thank goodness, because the GoPro failed to, uh, to come up with anything. And I don't particularly want to walk back down there again. It's very, very steep. I think I'll walk over. I'm going to show you. I'll walk over. Hang on a minute. Okay, I'm going to have a quick walk over again and uh, try and show you the steps. As I just said, it's a little bit annoying because having already done these steps <laughs> and then realised that the, the camera didn't pick anything up. Ah, frustrating or what? I don't know why either. That's the worst thing, not knowing why it didn't, it didn't come on. Anyway, I'm not going to walk down again. I'll probably give myself a heart attack. But, uh, I'm just going to show you, and then I'll show you the the inside. There we are. That's um, St. Govan's Chapel. Wow, not a lot to see. I didn't expect to see much in there. It's uh, that's amazing. Oh God, I don't want to go ass over Ted. Like almost then. bird there. Say nothing. Keep out military firing range. Anyway, I'm glad I've been there. It's, it's kind of worth seeing, but 
I don't know, at the same time a little bit underwhelming. It's just a, a stone building, looks like a slate roof on it, and completely empty. But my God, look at the po look at the uh, scenery. Right, that's it. Goodbye to St. Govan's and Castle Martin Firing Range. This oh dear. Thank you, sir.